Hey guys, Richard 102 here, back with another video review. Today I've got it on the Halo 3 Limited Edition. I got this off Amazon, again, as always, it's just where I get all my Halo stuff from, because they do good deals. Anyway, I got this um, second hand off of Amazon. Um, it was, it was in, it's in really good condition, I think, anyway, for the problems that it actually had itself. So, anyway, let's get on with the review. So it says like Xbox 360, you know, only on Xbox 360. The big free there for Halo 3 looks awesome. Um, Halo 3 there, then you turn it around, and it's got all that Desperate Enemy, a Desperate War, all about it, all the different things you get with it. Free there, and then some screenshots of it, and it's got the sticker for some reason. Um, only problem that I don't like with this is it, it's just, you can push it out either way, which, the reason why I like the um, Halo Wars Limited Edition, it has like a bottom, so you can only push it one way, so it doesn't slide out. But it doesn't really matter too much, it's still awesome. So yeah, that's the sleeve, the sleeve was in really good condition. And the tin has got massive dent here, but it doesn't really matter, it doesn't really stand out or anything. But yeah, it's got three, and then three the other side. So, in this side, it has the game, game disc. Um, this was moved, like, really bad, and this didn't stick properly, so I literally just ripped it off and superglued it again, which I think everybody who bought this had to do that. But, you know, it's just the way it was made, it wasn't glued properly. But there we go. Um, it's got a really awesome background, it shows, like, all the different Halo 3 weapons. It does look really, really cool, actually. Um, manual, it's got a different cover the manual, but it's all the same thing. Really cool, really cool um, bit there. Mine came with this Virgin Media spam, but it's got Halo 3 on it, so I kept it. Yeah. Um, and then it came with this book, which I can't pronounce the name. It's, um, it's like Bestiarum or something, I don't know. But it's got a really cool Forerunner type thing there. It's a hardback, like the um, graphic novel you get with Halo Wars. Um, you open it, it's all black until you get to the pages, which then it's just a catalogue of every species. So it's like got grunts, drones, um, flood pure form, then it's got humans, Spartans, and then just all about the different um, tires of technology achievement. So it's got transcendent world builders, in stellar space firing. So it's got all that. It's really cool information, actually. It's got a lot of information about the Halo universe, and it's also got an awesome height chart at the back. So that's re that's really cool to get. Um, kind of give you a better look at the um, background there. Yep. So yeah. Um, yeah. Th this um, has always had problems. It's you know, it's always been really easy to you know, bend and all that, and it's, that, that was the main problem with it. Yeah, that's on. Then the other side, open it up, and then it's just got that on there. And then, here's the limited edition, which this has fallen down, and I cannot take it off. So, I mean, you know, it's, it's gone from there, all the way down to there. And that's actually still sticky, which is pretty disgusting, if I'm honest. But the disc is fine, actually, which is good. But that's the limited edition essentials. It's got um, behind the scenes of making of Halo 3. Um, got loads of different wallpapers, gamer picks, all stuff like that. It's got a fun little Warthog game, actually, which is pretty fun. Um, and then it's got some other stuff, which is really cool. It's cool to watch the um, behind the scenes and get a good glimpse in that. And I like it because it's on disc, which the Halo Reach version, you have to, like, put in the code, and I just can't find it on Xbox Live, so... I've given up with that, but still, really cool, really cool to get the extras, um, <coughs> you get some pretty cool gamer picks that, like, nobody else would have unless you have this, obviously, or the, um, Legendary Edition, which I'm planning on getting the Legendary Edition, um, for Christmas or something. <coughs> anyway, thanks for watching, that's the, um, review of the Halo 3 Limited Edition, great, definitely get it if you're a Halo fan. The reason why I bought it, I'm a big Halo fan, and I do want all the different editions, and it was great to get that little book and the extras. So, thanks guys for watching, and see you all in the next